All right, so here's my tutorial on how to use um, the Momento database app. I've just installed it on my husband's phone. This is what it looks like when you first open it up. So we're going to add a library. If you go into the online catalog and search for stamping plates, um, two of us have entered um, templates to use. And so you can look at both of them, decide which one you like better. This is the one, the top one is the one that I did and download it. Gives you the option to change what you want to name um, this library, if you want to change any of the fields or colors or anything like that, or you can just leave it the way I did it and click the check mark and it will create your library. Now, right now it says there are no entries, so you hit the plus to add an entry. And I have no idea what this is doing. Just a moment, please. All right, had hit the wrong button. Okay, hit the plus button down at the bottom. Come on, there we go. All right, here you can add all the information about the plate that you're adding. So you can either take a picture or um, upload one from your phone. Since this is my husband's phone, it has no pictures on it. So I will just take a picture of the plate and check. All right, so now it has that photo in as the photo. Put in the um, manufacturer as Bundle Monster. The plate number is BM. I don't know my husband's phone very well. There we go. Um, S178, and image types, these would be, I would call full nail design and a full plate design, since they're kind of a buffet style. Hit OK, and then you can put any type of notes, so I would put like deep etching in there. And then you can tag it with anything that you want for the image types. So like for this one, I could put landscapes, mushrooms, trees, ferns, fairies, mountains, deer, whatever. And anything that you put in there, will it be able to be searchable? So let's just put deer in there for right now. Click the check mark. And that one has been created. Shows the picture shows the name. If you swipe to the right, you can sort by all kinds of different things. I typically sort by um, manufacturer and then by plate number. And I can, you can also group. And again, I group by manufacturer. And so then I have the bundle monster group with one plate in it. Then up here at the top, if you do a search and we search for deer, it comes up with one entry that has the word deer. So backing back out of there, you hit the plus, you type in a new plate, do it for each of your plates. Hope that helps. Thanks.